Nihihi, <laughs> wake up, sleepyhead. It's Christmas morning. We've been waiting for this day all year. So are you gonna wake up or are you just gonna louse around all day? There you are. Oh, what? No Christmas morning kiss or anything? <laughs> Good morning, love. How'd you sleep? Well, I hope you slept well. If you hadn't, that would suck. I mean, it's Christmas morning. Waking up on the wrong side of the bed is not something you want to do. Besides, I have so much planned for today. <laughs> of course I do. You really think someone like me, an ultimate supreme leader like me, would fail to plan for Christmas morning? I mean, it's our first Christmas together. I wanted to make it special. Don't make me get all sappy. Just get out of bed. I've been preparing stuff for like two hours now and it's finally sunrise. So you finally have no excuse to keep sleeping. So get up. Now. Thank you. First order of business is to get dressed and then there might be a special breakfast waiting downstairs. Who knows? Maybe Santa brought it. <laughs> I, I wanted to make you something nice. It, it feels like every other day of the year you put up with me and all the stuff I do and I thought I would just give you a day where I, I return the favor. Don't think of it as anything other than that. Normally, I would never do something like this, and don't expect it again. But I hope you do enjoy, because it means a lot to me that you do. I've been planning this for a little bit. Um, I've been keeping my secret notes under the bed and making sure that you didn't see anything. But the day's finally here, and you don't have any excuse not to experience all of it. Every bit of what I've planned, my perfect masterpiece. So get up, right now. Good. I already picked out an outfit for you. It's comfy, yet stylish, yet festive. Something that you definitely want to wear. So... Go change into it. Now. There you are. See, I told you you'd look great in it. I picked out that outfit just for you. Now it's time to go downstairs. I didn't prepare all this stuff for nothing, and it's getting cold. Well, do you like it? It's not much, and you you know I don't really know how to cook, but I thought I would make you some eggs and bacon and a side of cranberry sauce, and then a cup of eggnog, because, well, I love eggnog. I didn't really know if you liked it. I never really asked you, but if you don't like it, you better drink it anyway, because I didn't go out there and buy eggnog just for you not to drink it. Got it? Good. So, yeah. Am, am I doing good? Am, am I making this a good Christmas? I'll be honest, I haven't really ever done anything like this before, and so I, I don't know if this is good, but I, I, I really did try, and I, I don't know how to do this. 
I'm sorry. I, I, it's, it's, it's probably not what you were looking forward to, and it's not big. Um, but I, I tried my best, and, and he like it. And I, I mean, of course you like it. Uh, of course you like it. I, I made it all just for you to like it, and you, you don't, you, you don't remember what happened just there. I, I was always very confident in what I did. Of course, I've been planning it for like a month now. So eat your food right now. And, well, I have something else for you. But it'll have to wait. Until then, I suppose I could just get a little closer to you. I mean, it's a really cold morning, and I mean, I, I, we do have blankets, but they're all the way over there, and I just thought maybe it's better to conserve body warmth. Hmm. Thank you. A lot for for everything. Like I said before, um, this, this is something I really wanted to make happen. Be because you really put up with a lot through me, um, throughout the year. Um, and, I mean, I'm not oblivious to it. I, I know that you, you, you put up with a bunch throughout the year, and yet you still decide to stay with me, and you, you're so kind and sweet all the time, and every time I, I fuck up or do something I'm not supposed to or make one too many jokes, you're always so understanding, and I'm really thankful for you. I'm really thankful that you like me back. I, I wanted to give you something, and I was gonna wait till later, but I think this is the right time. If if that's okay. Here. Merry Christmas. Now, it's not much, and don't expect much, because you're gonna be thoroughly disappointed if you expect a lot. Um... But it's, well, you'll see. Just open it. Careful. I spent a lot of time wrapping that. <laughs> what is it? What is it? You dummy. It's a matching phone case. See? This one's white and purple, and mine matches you. I thought that maybe if I got you a matching phone case, whenever you look at it, you'll think of me, and everyone knows you look at your phone a lot. Um, so, I don't know. <laughs> maybe it's a stupid idea, but I... You like it? Like you actually like it? Like you're not playing with me? Like really? Wow. I I've always been really bad with gift giving. Because I, I never really know what to give. But if you really like it, um, then everything else doesn't matter. This is going to be a great Christmas. Because it's already starting out well. And you know what? I've got much more surprises planned, so don't you think that this is all I planned. Merry Christmas. I love you. I hope you know that. And I hope this next year will be a little bit better for both of us. We can only keep hope, right? Merry
Merry Christmas, my love.